Ah, uh, good morning, Joe Bond reports live. I have just left a town on the Victoria, New South Wales border called Corriong. Now, Corriong, I found out, is the home of the man from Snowy River. Now, whilst I could have stopped in town and I really wanted to stop specifically and stay overnight in town, unfortunately, I couldn't because we left Tang Ambalanga at seven. So we got to Corriong at 8.30, nothing's open. It's the day after Boxing Day 2019, so I'll just have to come back. Now, as we're coming along the Murray Valley Highway, heading towards the Snowy Alpine Highway, I came across this little rest stop. I'll tell you what, I'm coming back here. Lots of free camps, by the way. And I've come across something down there that I'm going to show you in a minute. It's called the Murray Crayfish. Now, the Murray Crayfish is the second largest freshwater crayfish species in the world. Never knew that. Now, it's uh, normally found along the middle and the upper reaches of the Murray and Murrumbidgee River systems in New South Wales. They prefer rocky bottoms, fast running, cold water areas with a riparian vegetation where the species feeds on decaying aquatic plants and animals. Now, they breed at around six to nine years of age and they weigh up to three kilos. Best bit, the local indigenous people enjoyed eating the Murray Cray as the meat is an, a delicacy. The women were also known to craft delicate necklaces from the legs of the Murray Cray. Now, I'm just going to give you a bit of a I tell you what, that river is absolutely freezing. No wonder it's coming off the uh, alpine. It's very cold up there. But I had no idea this was here. And apart from my very dusty caravan and car with two beautiful dogs inside that are being very patient, have a look at this. There you go. It is the crayfish. It's even got a tail. Made out of tin. How good's that? I just had to tell you, Joe Bond reports live just outside Corriong, New South Wales, Victorian border. See if you can see that sign over there, it says Victoria. Anyway, have a great day.